This is why Shaolin Monk is able to defeat and dominate any opponent. You are a girl, you are a fan of martial arts, or at least you like to watch people practicing these sensational sports. In fact, for some time now, little idea has been running through your head. Why not practice a martial art yourself? You like the idea, but you are quickly cooled down because this dream seems inaccessible to you. Wait a minute, don't rush and look at what I'm going to show you. The girls you see in these pictures are ordinary girls. Well, they were until they decided to take up martial arts. If you become like them, you too will be able to break steel bars with your shin, break bricks with the palm of your hand, fight any man no matter how big or small he is or even balance on your index finger. But be careful, I am not saying that it will be easy. On the contrary, to achieve such a result, you will need years of hard work. But in the end, when you see what you will be able to do just by moving your toes, you will not regret a single moment. You like to play ping pong from time to time with your friends, and you've been thinking about improving your skills or even becoming a professional. It's not that I am a spoiled sport, but I'd like to show you something before you take the plunge. The man you see in these pictures is a Shaolin monk, and he has a crazy talent. He is able to send back a maximum of ping pong balls against an unusual opponent, a robot. Look at his reactivity, his speed and his ease of play. They are really unbeatable. To become like him or better than him, you'll have to get up early, very early. But maybe with perseverance and hard work, you'll manage to hold the world record for the most balls returned to a robot. I feel that this has motivated you more and that's good. All that's left is to wish you good luck. You bought a nice dress a while ago because you want to look great for a big party this summer. The only problem is that you've put on a few pounds after eating raclette and fondue savoyards. Result? Your dress doesn't fit you anymore. I have the solution for you. Do like this kung fu master, he has the ability to move his bones in such a way as to make his body shrink and to be able to put on a little girl's shirt. And even better to insert four big bottles of wine underneath. He has an incredible technique of shrinking the body, a technique that probably took him years of work. So you have two options. Either you start working on this technique to be able to put on your dress or you open your mouth only to speak. That will be very hard. I'm sure that you already opt for the first solution. It will allow you at least to continue to taste your good, comforting dishes with a clear conscience. You are a tough and stubborn person. In fact, people always say that you are stubborn by nature. But you think that there are people who are even harder headed than you are. You want us to show them to you, don't you? Then open your eyes, well because you will hallucinate. This Shaolin monk agreed to do some experiments for a TV report about the prowess of Shaolin monks. He was given a fairly thick iron bar and challenged to bend it just by hitting it on his skull. The monk did not hesitate to do so and started right away. He took the iron bar and slammed it hard against his head repeatedly until it was twisted. Unbelievable, but true. I know your head hurts just looking at this, but thankfully it's not your head that's taking the beating. Now, indeed, you can say that some people have a harder head than yours and that after all it's still okay to have a strong character, as long as you don't twist anyone with it. You've always admired tightrope walkers, people who manage to find balance in their lives. Well, in the true sense of the word, and you would have loved to be just like them. Just a little. Watch the following sequence, it will make you admire him even more. This man has an exceptional talent, at least relative to people like you and me. He is able to balance on a bar held diagonally over the void. Hard to imagine? Then look at this incredible feat. He manages to hold on for several long seconds while it is physically impossible to hold on a vacuum for less than a fraction of a second. On top of that, he can do other techniques known to Shaolin monks, like balancing on his index fingers or performing amazing kung fu techniques. Are you shocked? 
There is no need to be. Now you know that Shaolin monks will never stop pushing the limits of what is possible. You find that your older sister's children tend to spend their whole day in front of the television. Would you like them to be more active? I have the solution to motivate them and give them a little boost. But I warn you, it won't be a piece of cake. Tell them about Ryusei Imei, the little boy of only 7 years old, who is able to do extraordinary physical feats. So much so that he is called the little Bruce Lee. No taller than three apples, and yet Ryusei is able to do things that an adult could not do. For him, push-ups on his index fingers are fun. Fights are fun. Splits, handstands and all other kinds of advanced gymnastic tricks don't seem to require more effort than lifting a glass of water. Seeing these images has made your head spin? You are already changing your mind and prefer your little nephews to sit quietly in front of the TV. At least you will be sure that they won't break their fingers, that they won't hurt anyone and that they won't break anything at home. You think you're a little chubby. Your little tummy is starting to show and you're already thinking about building up your abs for this summer. The only problem is that you hate the gym. I think I have the solution that may satisfy you. Instead of joining a gym, go on a retreat to a Shaolin monk. Only he could make your abs as strong as reinforced concrete. In fact, look at how he has the uncanny ability to take violent blows from sticks to his abs. They are so hard and strong that he doesn't get hurt when they are hit. On the contrary, he is able to contract them in such a way as to absorb the shock and send the blow back to its recipient. I am sure that you too can achieve this result with willpower, but I don't hide from you that you will sweat, and not only a little, but you will also even suffer a lot. But it's always better than going to train in a dreary gym. At least it's exotic. I can feel that this little sequence has motivated you. So what are you waiting for to call a Shaolin monk? For you, a needle is for sewing. For a Shaolin monk, it is used to do something else. You do want to know, don't you? Well, it's just around the corner. Watch this amazing video. This Shaolin monk has the incredible ability to pierce a window by just throwing a needle with his bare hands without the window cracking. To achieve this, the Shaolin monk has to throw his needle at the mind-boggling speed of 150 km per hour, which no normal human being can do. Then he does it with such a great force that the needle crashes against the glass and pierces it to come out on the other side. The pain does not shatter because glass is an amorphous material, meaning that when the needle hits the glass, the force is not transferred to the entire pane, but to a localized point. This means that in the end, there is only a tiny hole that forms on the surface of the glass. It's absolutely amazing, don't you think? Are Shaolin monks starting to scare you? Don't worry, they are still normal human beings, except that they spend their lives training. If you want to do it too, I don't recommend it, because it's a very hard exercise. However, you can always admire them and their prowess from afar. When the first Shaolin monks started to practice Kung Fu, they realized that despite all their efforts, they were very vulnerable and far outmatched by animals, by mixing human intelligence, which animals do not have. This Shaolin monk, for example, is in the middle of nature. He is carrying out drastic trainings of Kung Fu techniques, imitating animals and especially their main fighting and defense positions. You love combat sports and especially Kung Fu for its incredible techniques. Do you want to watch an extraordinary training session? Beware, you will be amazed. This Kung Fu master is definitely unbeatable. He has an incredible talent, the one to fight several men at the same time with a minimal effort. Look at how he channels his strength into his handles, his forearms and the palms of his hands. Once men try to attack him, the man manages to throw them all back in such a way that they end up on the ground because of the prodigious strength that blocks them. Does the idea of having to confront a Kung Fu Titan like this scare you too? It's normal. But at the same time, who wouldn't be terrified of fighting this man? Maybe you could ask your Kung Fu coach to teach you this technique. 
You admire MMA fighters a lot, and you wonder if there are people on Earth who could fight these people with their extraordinary strength. I have the answer to this question, but I warn you, you may not like it. Yes, MMA fighters can be beaten by fighters who are not trained for MMA. I'm talking about Shaolin monks. The proof is in this short passage found on the net. It is about a bare knuckle fight organized in the 1950s in a boxing ring in an unknown place, which opposed a kickboxing fighter to a Shaolin monk who came to fight in traditional monk's clothes. The film only showed the opening 55 seconds or so, which is enough and gives a glimpse of how the rest of the match unfolded. From the very beginning, the fighter started by unleashing ultra-fast kicks and punches against the monk, who was no less reactive. The latter calmly charged each blow before taking his turn to attack his opponent in a fast and violent way. He was clearly faster, more fluid and more confident. And he had reason to be. You may be disappointed to learn that MMA fighters can be vulnerable to Shaolin monks, but this is your chance to learn more about these extraordinary people and their incredible feats. Now, tell us in the comments what you think about these amazing techniques of the Shaolin monks. And don't forget to subscribe and click here to watch another of our videos.